Today I get a, a Convenant 7X uh, rifle scope from Cabela's. This is a branded Cabela's uh, scope. Uh, it's a 34 millimeter tube, and um, I believe this is a 5 uh, to 35 uh, magnification. It's an FFP with milrad, uh, tree like uh, uh, reticle. Okay. Now this is retail maybe for 350 bucks, but it was on sale for 250. I could not pass this deal. I looked some of the uh, the reviews, initial reviews and feedback. Everybody liked it. They said they said it's a, a clear optics. Uh, it has um, uh, turrets uh, with locking uh, uh, down on the elevation only, so you can lock the turret. Um, with the C actually it has a zero stop not locking it's a zero stop on the locking uh, feature so you can set the zero stop on the elevation only okay so this is uh, gonna go on a rim fire um, and uh, I, I all what care about is whether it's a, a clear a clear uh, scope clear optics and it, it is really clear optics I like it a lot and um, um, the controls on the on the uh, the turret controls and the feel of them is very very good. So let us open this box and have a look. Okay, uh, this is the Covenant uh, rifle scope manual, and um, the the scope came up with the with the um, the one the uh, the FFP on the on the side on the right side which is um, TX5-35 times 56 FFP reticle, okay? And uh, this is one with the, the one I ordered. Uh, this, those are the information and the manual. Um, so we're gonna put it aside. This is another manual, maybe user instruction from Cabela's. So most likely this is a, a Chinese made scope, okay? Uh, they are improving many many uh, people uh, discount uh, chinese ones but the latest ones like even the athlon ones are made in china and they're getting, uh, they are getting better and better of course they are not uh, as good as japanese class nor the german class okay uh, which are the leading uh, manufacturer of the optics worldwide with their clarity okay so let us open this see what's inside it okay um, I already opened one, so we're gonna open it again. Uh, this is uh, a cleaning wipes uh, cloth. Okay, it came uh, with a, an extension, but no front and rear cover. Okay, for two fifty bucks, you cannot expect too much from uh, that. Okay, now I'm using one handed, so uh, using the cell phone in one hand and the second in another. Uh, this is 34x, uh, 35x scope at the maximum magnification, and it has seven, uh, 7x between the lower and the upper magnification level. Okay, uh, this is 535 FFP. Okay, uh, it has uh, zero, zero stop for the elevations, but um, uh, left and right. For the windage, they don't they don't have a spot. They don't have a lock, which you, most of the time you don't need it. Okay, uh, it's a bit long, maybe it's heavy, but um, for for being sturdy and uh, uh, to protect the scope um, uh, internals, maybe this is a good idea to keep it like this. Um, there is here a lever, and you can add it here. It comes with it too. I believe this is it for fast control uh, so um, controlling this is not very tough however I found out that controlling the uh, the focus side focus or if you call it a parallax is really tough okay so it's really really tough to make adjustment I don't know why it's so tough maybe it will loosen with time but this is very very tough now with the controls on the elevation Okay, it's, it's not that bad at all, okay? Uh, 
I can, I, you, there is a tactile feel to it and we'll go back to zero stop and we'll stop actually. So it's not that bad for the turrets. The windage is also uh, tactic, uh, tactical, uh, tactile and you can feel them and you can get them back to zero quickly. Uh, so I could not complain. I looked up outside. Um, there is no uh, um, kind of like uh, dust or any kind of uh, particles inside the, the scope. So it's a very clear scope actually. I like it so far. The controls are not the best, but for 250 bucks you cannot complain, especially when this is an FFP. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you like the video and um, uh, subscribe to my channel, like and share if you would like to receive the latest uh, videos. Thank you.